Okay, Gator. So Ranbot did reply to my last message, um, making fun of him, but it wasn't funny enough to play, so he can just mope about it, I guess. However, Gator, the Gator Game or Stalker Children, has uh, stepped down from his lofty clouds where he enjoys um, dazzling success as the host of the Anime Booma podcast. And has graced us all with his presence. And he has decided um, to... Uh, <laughs> he's decided to issue an apology regarding the Kiki the Pedophile anime VTuber thing. Um, so here's his apology. You ready, chat? Hello. I am the Geta Gamer, host of the Anime Bruma podcast. I am making this video to speak directly to you, the fans of Anime Boomer Podcast, and everyone who support the VTuber industry. First of all, I deeply apologize for causing concern to many people. Please allow me this time to address your concern. First, let me apologize for a misunderstanding. In regard to association with a particular VTuber, I have no relationship, friendship, or otherwise crucial association with a particular VTuber. For the safety of myself and others, I chose to move on from support. I did not know the backstory nor history of this particular VTuber. Most of my exposure to this particular VTuber was through corroboration of other VTuber. I am a viewer of many VTuber, went to many meet and greet at Ofkai Expo that were not arrive. This is not indicative of the level of support of any one particular VTuber. There is much misinformation regarding which VTuber I follow is number one. That has been and remain former Rain Prof of Niji Sanji Ien and any future incarnation. I deeply regret this outcome and will be rethinking how I support VTuber in the future. I regret the way this has negatively affected the VTuber industry where VTuber not involved have been receiving hurtful messages. I deeply apologize to the VTuber and to everyone that supports them. We are taking this situation very seriously. We will be implementing several new internal systems to ensure that this kind of situation does not occur in the future. To everyone who has and continues to support VTuber, I am very sorry that situations were allowed to arise where our actions resulted in problems for you and your community. I feel that should never be the case. Once more, personally, and on behalf of our podcast, I apologize to you all for causing concern. As the Anime Boomers podcast, we will do everything we can to ensure that we create and maintain an environment where VTuber can succeed in their creative endeavors. Thank you. Okay, if you are confused by this, do not worry. And also, if the fan is too loud, let me know. Um, what he is doing is imitating the Niji Sanji apology. A long time ago, I think I even covered this on stream, a big production company called Niji Sanji let go one of their VTubers, who was a Japanese-American with a mostly American audience. Uh, she had a mental breakdown and uh, was let go. And Americans who were confused at why... Um, Japan, who were confused and didn't really empathize with the Japanese like slave workforce culture were very angry at them. So they had to come out. By the way, this is one of the most cringe fucking things ever. Watch this shit. <laughs> like, he, yeah, when a Japanese person like fucks up business, they have to do like a full bow to the audience. It's so creepy. I don't know why. I, and then I, I said this to the VTubers like, you don't even understand a culture that has respect for their fellow man like Japan does. I don't know. I just don't want to make us bowing at me and shit. I ain't, no, I ain't no fucking slave driver over here. I just want to know why they fired the weirdo. Anyways, that's what he's making fun of. Um, I don't know. Can I rift off this? Hero Gator. The Gator Game All. <laughs> you say that you did not know that she was a pedophile, but yet she did big stream where she say for hours about her weird fetishes. Uh, and said that she drove off to little girls. That you do not seem faced by this. And you have not even acknowledged this. 
and you went to a convention center and uh, talked to an iPad and even took a selfie with the iPad and then sent your selfie with yourself next to an iPad to Rambot. And then you also uh, said that it was I who misunderstood the context of this conversation. Uh, by the way, so this uh, <laughs> this apology satisfied no satisfies nobody because obviously, like um, obviously, you fucking knew. Like, come on. And then on the second one, it's like you're throwing her under the bus. Like, here's the thing, right? And I think that even I think honest. How do I refer to them? The honest inter people who. If if you are a performer who does a character in, in the VTuber sphere, and you're intellectually honest, I think it would be pretty fair to say that anime culture is adjacent, directly intermingled with the lollycon shit. And it's very hard in the West to not outright call that pedophilia, because it's obvious. <laughs> it's very creepy, it's very weird. There's a reason why a lot of people don't stick that to their name. Um, you, you might have personalities that, that defend it or whatever or say they're into it, but you're not going to find a real person with a real name saying that because it's obvious what it is. Um, so when Gator tries to placate one side because Kiki is very fucking gross by throwing her under the bus, well, you can't do that. You're in a no-win situation because um, the responses to this are going to be negative. I bet you if I open the replies, they're all going to be negative. Um, how do you respond to allegations of you being into lolly fecal matter consuming porn? Is it true in the VTuber in question we're seen together at a love hotel after the con? So this guy is in on the joke, even though it's a bad joke. Um, parroting a bad company is a snarky way to toss someone like yesterday's garbage is an option, I guess. A very bad option... But one that fits you, I suppose. This is the most upvoted or most liked reply. So, of his own audience, whatever it may be, uh, this guy is saying what I suspected. That you can't really denounce Kiki and her weird fucked up fetishes because that is anime. <laughs> that is the audience. Uh, if you denounce the, the lollicon weirdo, well, you're denouncing like a huge swath of the people who listen to you, whether you want to admit it or not. This is gay, girlish, and cringe. Be a man and grow small balls. No, needs to be fatter and hairier. How was the boat gator? I don't know what that means. You fumbled this one, bud. <laughs> I think you should refrain from naming any VTubers that you watch. You'll only end up invoking the tipster effect on them. <laughs> this guy, who is probably like an actual fan of Gators, he's like begging him, please don't involve any of my anime babes in your fucking podcast because you're a fucking loser and everyone hates you. And if you try to be friendly with them, you'll attract negative attention to them. But that's not going to happen. Like, the whole reason why Gator does this podcast is to talk to anime babes. Uh, like, spooky weeb trash and shit. Like, this is just an avenue of, like, meeting girls in the space. He's going to want to have as many VTubers as guests on his show as possible. Um, I, almost, I am almost certain you were aware of her tag tier list stream, as it is her most popular stream... And it would have been how a lot of people found her. I think you have been stuck to your guns here. It would have been more interesting to see, but oh well. Is this the same guy as up here? I swear I saw him twice. No, no, I'm confusing him. Yeah, I mean, there's no way he didn't. Get on Ozempic. People will take you more seriously. <laughs> Seems racist to me. Okay, but did you smash? That was gay. Look, son, a fucking idiot. Even his own audience is like, uh, eh, that's ain't it, Chief. You're gonna have to issue an apology for the apology gator. You're accidentally you accidentally did a racist and you accidentally denounced lollycon culture, which is a cornerstone of the industry. Sorry, buddy. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!